Hello friends, in this video we are going to learn how to import, export CSV or Excel file to database, right? So let's start with it. So first of all, what we have to do is we have to follow this following steps which I have already written. First of all, we need to use this com com command with the composer required map website Excel. So for the Excel import CSV and all, we need to use this. After this, we need to go to the config app.php. I have already uh, I have already run this commands, right? So I will explain you all this. So first, I have run this command sudo composer require method site. After this, I have added PHP artisan migrate. There is no migrate, so I have uh, created some of the dummy data with the help of PHP artisan tinker. After this, I will add this command user factory account create 20 users. So it will create the 20 users at the runtime, right? So we need to export or import that. After this, I have created the PHP artisan make import users. So in, we have created two folders import and export with the users import name, right? So that is used for uh, import and export functionality. So if I go and I will show you in my folder. So here app config. Sorry, it's in config app.php. So here I have added two providers. This is MathWebs Excel service provider, and here I have added Excel MathWebs areas. Right, these two things. After this, we have go for the running by running the two commands that we have shown you: import and export. When these two commands, when you run these two commands that I showed you, this one, uh, this. Um, it is this import users right and export users import with model user right if you run these commands this two four files export users export will open so in this file we have returning all the users so you don't need to add anything because whenever you uh, create this run this command it will automatically generate this file right so don't need to do anything in this file after in the in import uh, in the second one we need to do something in imports because what you are trying to import this will automatically come with the function model return so this is this is this will not there what are you want to return what you want to import right so here I am returning email username uh, email and password right so this how we are using right so let's um, this is done after that we need to create the routes in the routes I am using my send email controller in send email controller I have created import export or import with the function name right so this gonna be in the send controller in send controller I have added export import and import export view that is called, this is an import plate for uh, showing this is the function export and import that is uh, we have already created uh, for uh, this one import and export that function calls and it will do their respective uh, job right so see I have added this uh, uh, this Excel MathWebs Excel right so this you need to add the dependency over here and uh, use this function this function if you go to the you can say um, in the their vendor folder you will get this command how to download or you can go to the official website of this uh, MathWorks website it will give you this command right so you will use right like this okay after doing this controller we have done uh, routes we have done and after that we have we need to go for the views so let's go to the Arabe route resources views and here I am creating the import plate where I have created form right and button import and export users, right so after this let's go to the this web file so um, if you want to export the data this will export the whole data open this see all the data is there whatever I have in the users for the users this is the 22 records and here what we have 22 records right so it will export all that with the simple function it will call and it will run after this we have to import the users data so I need to create a uh, import data here 
so let me uh, remove this and uh, cancel okay so here I'm going to add a uh, uh, test this create uh, gmail.com password admin on hash here I'm going to change it this with this one hurry this so it just took to this I'm going to do this okay and this password save this and we're going to import this browse empty right this is done let's check two records with ss and with this are imported successfully right so this is way this is the way that you can import and export through database example i will recap all the things with the the video with this one so um, first of all you need to use this command after that in config app.php you need to write this after that you need to run php artisan migrate then php artisan tinker with this command it will create your uh, users right in the you need to define this routes in your routes web.php after this you need to create I'll, uh, this one i will uh, delete this part so that i will explain easily right in uh, make import users import model uh, this folder you need to add this line so whatever you want to import right with the you here you need to pass the like a uh, index of the excel sheet after that you need to run this command exports users import model user after this uh, this do, don't need to uh, uh, like touch this file because it automatically creates everything after that you need to create the controller in controller you need to create import export because here we have defined import export export and import functions right so you need to define the export with the excel command and import with this excel command and return back right and you need to create the import blade <laughs> here we have created a form for the import so it will directly hit to the import file and import the data and in export we have used the route that is export function so it will export the data in the user's xls file which we have already written in this file user xls store right so this is how we can uh, import and export the csv or excel file in laravel 8 thank you so much for watching this video have a great day